In this video, I'm going to teach you how you can access geometry from a vector layer using QGIS. So we're going to use this vector layer of streams and we're going to use PyQGIS to loop through and get the geometry or the points that make up each of these lines. So to start off, um, as always, we'll open up the Python console and I'm going to open up my script editor and I am going to create a new script and I'm going to start off here with the file name and just make sure I get that from here okay and then like we always do um, we want to load a layer so we'll do layer equals QGS vector layer vector layer sorry about that the file name we'll give it an empty layer name and then the data provider is OGR and then we want to get the features of this layer I'm going to call them feats and so we'll do layer not later layer dot get features and then we want to loop through those features or iterate over the features and so we'll do for feature in features and the next thing we want to do is we want to get the geometry. And that's actually quite a simple thing to do. So we're going to do geom or geometry equals feet dot geometry. Okay. So now once we have the geometry, there are a few things we're going to need before we can actually print that geometry out. And we'll go through those now. So the first thing is we want to know if this geometry is a single type. And I'm going to write the code out and I'll explain what that means. So we'll call this variable uh, geom single type. And we're going to do QGS WKB types. Okay. And then is single type. And we're going to then go geom.wkb type. Okay, so with the geometry types, you can have a single type, which is what we're asking here. This is going to give us a Boolean variable, and it's true or false if this is a single type. So you can have single types or multi types. Um, and multi types just have multiple features in a single type, and single types just have a single feature in a single type. And because there are different types, that geometry gets retrieved differently, and so that's why we're going to check for this. Uh, we're going to need this variable to, to print those out. Now, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to put in an if statement. So if geom.type is equal to QGS WKB types dot line geometry, which will be expected to be, then here is where we're going to be able to print out the line attributes. And here's where we need to check the single type, single type or not. So if geom single type, we're going to do one thing. If I can type, and then the other is else, we're going to do something else. Okay, and so here's where we'll put the code if the geometry is a single type, and here's where we'll put the code if the geometry is a multi type. Okay, so I forgot some parentheses right here, and so now we can go ahead and get that geometry. So we'll call it geometry x equals geom uh, and then we need to get that geometry which we simply do with as polyline oops polyline not polygon and then we can go ahead and print that so we'll print the this is a line and then we'll print the geometry okay and then if it's not a single type, if it's a multi-type, then we can do x equals g on as multi-polyline. And then we'll print multi-line. 
and we can print x, which will give us uh, all the points for that. So let's go ahead here and we will click run on this and what we should get printing out here is we should get a long list of line coordinates or point coordinates basically. So I'm going to click run script and we have an error. Let me find out what our problem is here. And so I think maybe there are not parentheses on that. Let's click run sure enough. That's just a uh, an enumerator basically so we don't need parentheses to call it and you can see that I printed all these out here and so if we come down and look at a multi-line here we can see what that consists of and what we have is we have a QGIS point QGIS point XY and so here are the point coordinates for a point and here's another point and there are the coordinates for that point and so on and so forth and so this multi-line uh, is just made up of a series of points that are those vertices along the line. So that is a pretty quick video on how you're able to get the geometry information from a shapefile. Now if I were to do this with a point shapefile or polygon shapefile, I would follow this uh, exact same procedure except when I have these uh, geometry types, I would put uh, the point geometry here or the polygon geometry here and then I'd instead of as polyline I would say as point or as multi-point or as polygon or as multi-polygon and just adjust this accordingly. And I'll show you here, this is in the PyQGIS user's guide or the cookbook um, which I have the link to on my website, go ahead and check that out. It shows how you can do this, how you can set up a, a loop that will distinguish the geometry type and print out the correct geometry based on the type you have. And so that's from getting a lot of this information that I'm showing you is from the, the PyQGIS cookbook. So if you have questions, uh, you can go there for uh, a more full description of some of these things. Some of the things I discuss aren't in there. They're still updating it for version 3 of QGIS. Um, but there is information there that you can use. Once again, as always, if you have questions, leave a com comment below. If there are other tutorials you'd like to see, leave a comment below and I will get to those. And thank you for watching.